Hello everybody, this is Sonia. I'm in Australia and it's not a nice day today but I'm just when you put this when I put this up it might be a bit better, I don't know, but we're um working on this piece still. And probably will be for quite a few <laughs> years maybe. Hope not. I wanna get it done as soon as I can because then I got nothing. I got things that I want to do. So um, lots of things that I want to make and work at, you know, besides what I've done for all them years, the same things, you know, when I say the same things, I've done a, a lot of, I suppose I've done a lot of different things. Now, when I'm going around here this time, okay, I've got all this thread here, what have I got here, why didn't I cut that off? Um... We don't need all that hanging around as a part of the thing. I if I picked up at something and just sewed it on there willy nilly. <laughs> Probably have you though, because this doesn't look like it belongs there, does it? What's it connected to? Oh, goodness me. There was nothing like that near there, it was there. Look. I've just picked up a piece of thread off the table with me cotton and just sewed it in. Ah oh dear, oh goodness me, Sonia. I have to cut it off there. It's just, it's just a random bit of thread. <laughs> Anything to get things caught up. Now this one here is sort of coming undone because it had a knot in it, but it's coming, it's coming undone, so I'm going to have to make sure I don't pull that through. I'm going to stitch it a bit better later. Goodness me. So now this time I'm actually um, when I'm going around with this piece, I'm got I've got it. I'm pulling it down a bit tighter um, when I'm couching it, so it'll, it gets a bit smaller just for the centre bit. Oh well, not centre, but we're not at the centre yet. We're just just making it so it's not so high. Fluffy. Oh goodness me, what's going on here? I'm gonna get these pieces out of my road. Okay, so I'm just gonna have a look and see if we actually on the screen here. I'm good. <laughs> That's a good thing, isn't it, that we're in the screen? Everybody's having a good time doing a bit of crafting and things. We're sitting down doing a bit of stitching in this rotten weather here we're having in Australia. I suppose it's winter, it is winter time after all, but really, you know. <laughs> this has to be. the way things are, isn't it, really? I'm looking forward to summer myself. I'm definitely looking forward to summertime. Alright. So that looks alright. I don't know if I need to put anything. No, that looks good. I'm good with that. Go back around through here again. This way. I never cut any off here because I didn't know how much I was going to use anyway. So that's all right. I don't know if I'm going to change it again too because I, I may, I very well could do. You never know. Get a different one for the centre.
Yeah, you know, back there a bit so have it line up with that one. Go on to there. <laughs> and put that down. I'm just making sure this timer thing was working. I might have to put another colour in the middle, eh? Because it just feels like it needs to have another different thing in there. For something that's not so thick either, but I'm going to use the same sort of thread, I think, as the same wool. Got to use the same wool. That looks really good, Sonia. That looks really good. Well, I really like it. It's what I'm going for. <laughs> look, I want to, that's what I wanted it to look like. Not exact, well, I didn't know I'd be able to see the blue stitches. Put it that way. I was just going to catch it. I didn't realise that that would look amazing until I said <laughs> Hey. So there's three rows of that, three rows of that, and I don't know. We'll put a different thing in the middle, eh? I don't know, we'll have to find something different, put in the centre of it. It isn't easy working on a bigger piece of material, you know, but it's... The outcome's going to be good, I think. I'm going to like the end result. I'll go down through there and then take this other piece, this yellow through to the back. off thread that and put it through to the back of here. Right. You need them you need all sorts of sizes of needles. Can't really say what this is. I think it's some sort of darning thing I think. too tight on you. Lift it up a bit. There we go. Now I'm going to sew these two things down here with this. I'm going to use this bit of blue. Fasten these down over here so they're not where I'm going to be working. Oh well. I don't want to pull them up. Keep lifting them up all the time. caught up. So I've got a little bit of this, so I'm going to keep working with it. Put the next piece down with it. Whatever that is going to be. I don't know yet, do we? We've even found it. Come through this on it. That back up in there. Mouthful of water. Talking too much is making me thirsty. Okay. So I need something else on the inside here. thing do you think I should put on there? Um, I'm going to be putting the, the, these colours around the outside, okay? Maybe not of this sort of thread though, because what I'm going to do won't work. So I need to... Oh dear, on this middle bit. chair. Oh, something for me to sit on. I can't sort of... 
shouldn't be complaining too much. What about if I put that in there? Oh, that's not going to do anything fantastic, is it? Okay, a bit of orange. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. <laughs> oh, isn't that nice? Oh, I do love that orange. But I don't want to put it on there yet. I just, I need to probably stick to the yellowish sort of plan thingy. Is it weird? There's really light underneath. Oh, well, not really, but a bit light under there, isn't it? About the green bit. No. Actually, that orange looked really good, didn't it? Bit of orange in there. I don't know why not. Oh, hang on, there's not, not much there. Is it orange right here? Look, there's only that bit. I wonder if that'll cover it, because I've got a, another colour there. This little wrinkly one. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's play. Let's get really. <laughs> Careful of fingers there, Sonia. I need them later. Okay. Needle. Bring us up through the bottom. These needles make a bit of hole, bit of holes. Now I want this not to be there, so we're going to pull that through like that. I haven't got the real orangey bit, have I? What have I done with my needle now? Here, I haven't got the really orangey bit, have I? No. But that's okay, because we can use. Orange one a bit more. Oh. That'll do. Will it? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Do I want this bit there? Oh. <sighs> Probably. How much will I need? A bit, a bit further. There, okay. I can't leave this piece on the back because <laughs> I'll keep getting caught in it. Good. Put it on the outside piece. Something around the outside of it. Nice. I get another piece of this blue thread that's keep, keep coming undone on me. Not a good idea. Okay. 
Okay. Alright, we'll do a lot of concentrate today. It's supposed to be something that you <laughs> slow stitching is good for relaxing. It's really good for relaxing. making yourself something interesting. Well, it's, I wonder I've got itchy face, I've got fluffy stuff all over the place here. Got fluffy stuff everywhere. Okay. Well, <laughs> help it in my mouth. <laughs> oh dear. Ah <laughs> oh dear, you never tame me. <laughs> through the yellow bit but I think I might have caught a bit of it now this thing just developed out of me starting to do the like the, the whole thing I mean I've got ideas I've got some stitches that I wanted to use and this has just come from me <laughs> I don't know putting it there this is what I wanted to make something using this sort of work inspired by a few people on YouTube Adrian Ad, Adrian Zusha Adrian Zusha I think that's her name she does a lot of this sort of stuff. She's really cool. I really like her things and I get um, inspired by what she does to... She does like... Let's call it... That's on the other hand. She does a lot of... She's left-handed. <coughs> as far as I know, she does a lot of left-handed um, work as well as some right-handed so not hard to follow she's got lots and lots of work though that she's done over the years heaps and heaps of it because she's um, a big fan of Sue Spargo which I don't mind her stuff as, as well as the same sort of things same sort of ideas I just like the um, look of these things and the colours. I love the colours. And of course, the, the embroidery is a lot of different techniques and everything. And Sue Spargo has a lot of threads, but if you can't buy them, that's okay. You can use your own things anyway. I'm sure she doesn't mean if you have to go and use her stuff. You can't afford to. And I definitely can't because I couldn't just have a couple of threads. I need a whole heap. Because we do. But I, I'm just using different um, things like so, so she would do wool, I guess, like this. I don't know. Um, I haven't really looked at that that much. I, uh, they have their own brands of stuff that they like to use, I suppose. We all like our own things. That's, that's a good thing, you know. So everybody can see that it doesn't matter what you've got, you can have a good... 
you never try it, you know. Have a go. Make it fun. Don't worry about having the most perfect thing to do it with. You know what I mean? <laughs> Same thing everybody else has got. Do your own, use your own stuff. And get just as good at um, work. I don't think they promote that. A lot of people don't promote their stuff that much, though, which is... Well, they promote it, but not, you know, don't say that you have to have this to do it with, because you don't. It's just like everything else that we do. All the scrapbooking and that <clears throat> that I've done. I guess I've had to have the things to do that with over the time, but that was um, <laughs> a different thing than if you want a cutting machine or something, you know. Oh, my old saw machine's going out to the dump. Well, it can't be used because there's something wrong with the electrical part of it and I don't want anybody to be playing around with it, so it's going to have to go be chucked out. Thrown out. Actually, I don't know when it's going to the dump because they have a pick-up day around here. Probably once a year, I guess. I don't think it's more often than that. And... Um, it's going to go out with that. <laughs> We've got an interesting lot of stuff this year. We have a TV, we have a microwave, we have a printer. Because <laughs> we've had to buy all new of that above. Yeah, so... <laughs> and the sewing machine. You have to do that, though. You can't... You've got to update eventually, I suppose. Can't really. Some things will last a long. I did well. Most of my things I did have a really long time. The television was a fair age. Microwave we've got a pretty good workout. Started sparking and spitting and carrying on. We thought it was the plates, but it wasn't. It was the microwave, so that was dangerous. Okay, so I'm going to push that back through here, I think. I mean, if I want a place for it to go through, uh, all that cotton. Oh! Meh! <laughs> go in there. Right. Gonna need help to push the needle through, goodness me. That's really nice, that is. I am a fan of that. You like that? Oh, I'm sorry, I hope I haven't been out of the shot. I was only doing the needle thing, so we're getting fixing up the end. Okay. That only gives a mist in the sink then. I have this too, this would be a good idea if I cut that off. I was supposed to, wasn't I? Yep, I was up to that. <laughs> wow, isn't that jazzy? I do like that. What do you reckon? Is that pretty good or what? <laughs> oh, no, I'm going to have to get more drink. <laughs> mm. When I say I have a drink, I only have, just have a tiny mouthful. I don't actually <laughs> drink a lot at a time. So maybe this was getting, making me thirsty. Look at that, isn't that nice? Bit of, bit of a cupboard on there. I'm having a serious look at the um, 
them here now because I know that I'm going to have to need some um, leaves but I might not have anything cut out I'm just having a quick look at that to see if I've got anything that will work there probably not for this I've got plenty of these so I don't mind if I cut this up for a minute to have a look see what it looks like I don't know whether to use that or, or wool. <coughs> wool fabric or something it's getting quite warm in here now um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm going to do the outside of this bit first. I'm going to keep working on here. So now I need to put some bits around. Mm -hmm. Some bits around. So I want uh, green, light, lighter colour on the green. I think. I'm going to make little things. And come out here <laughs> okay some of those I'll make some of those little things that come out there <laughs> I want a different color green than what I've got on there I'll do, I'll do what I do I yeah I want to use the green thing that's the same pretty close to it I mean it's not exactly the same how about that it's not very thick does it have to be very thick? Yeah, a bit thicker. Something a bit thicker. About that one there. That one there might work. I think. I'll go at that. I just want to make a st stitch out there so I can put something on it. Oh, I've got two lots of that linear. <laughs> so where those, um, where these bits are here, I'll put that. Go around there with these. And we'll go through. Indeed. Right. I'm just going to go through here and not play up on me. Very good. I want to stitch there. Stitch up here. Huh? Right. That looks cool. <laughs> Always pleased with myself. <laughs> oh dear, I suppose I hope you've been in the shot. It would be very nice if you have to if I have to redo this again or you miss it you'll miss it. So it won't be redone. <laughs> I can't redo it. Can't pull it out and do it again. Okay, so now I need a um, a purple. There goes my clock, my timer. I want a purple. Oh, and all move. 
why don't you just knock that down? So just, for goodness sake, stop doing that. <laughs> right, where's the thing? What about, no, I don't want a variegated one, I don't think. No, I don't. I have to get me a box out of here. Knock that thing down again, huh? Right, oh. So I've got this. Yes, that's a nice one. That's a nice one. I want a lighter colour one as well. See how we go with that first. I'm going to do a, a cast on. Oh. Sort of a cast on stitch. Yes, I am doing a cast on stitch. It's not sort of. It is. Now I'm going to do it first because um, there's one in the middle too. But I don't know if I need to put one in the middle. This flower. I know you know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry about that. But I'm just. I'm going to be showing you right now. So I'm going to start at the halfway with this, maybe. That could have went on to the name itself, couldn't it? That would have been a better idea. So we're going to put this around here. So we need to have... that going in there. Now I'm going to make it go around like that, okay? Well, that's up. <laughs> Little tiny. I'm making it look more awkward than it is, I think, I'm sure. <laughs> Nothing new there. So we're going to cast this on. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's got to go around the corner, okay? Eleven, twelve, okay, okay. I'll do fourteen. We'll remember that, won't we? Okay. Now this is this piece of thread is like it's actually nearly a wool as well. This is a piece of um, wool that I don't pull it up too far because you need it to spread out there. You go all the way around over the top of this. I right know. Let's put that back through there. In a minute I'll show you how to do that without getting everything in the road. So I'm going to come up here because I'm going to have to fasten it down. I'm going to put a stitch in it. So I'm going to fix this bit first, make it nice. And then I'm going to put a stitch in here to hold it there. Okay? Like that. How's that look? Pretty good, eh? Now, if I put another one here, oh, well, I will. I'm going to get down in there. And we need 14, and they're going to really nearly get hit onto one another, but I don't think that's going to matter. These ones won't. No, this one's too close. Oh, I'm going to leave it. It's not going to worry me. Because I'm going to like it, eh? <clears throat> I have to fix this stem though. This the piece that's coming out there, it's in in the mid air. It needs to be captured down there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 13, this is really cool, I'm ready to fry all this cotton off and curl it in a minute. Okay.
That's twisted. <laughs> that's got, well, that's twisted. Untwist that. So these these bits are going around that way instead of. You see what I'm doing? See how it's twisted up there? I think it is here too. Look. What have I done here? Oh no, it's all right. You just have to make it a bit snugger. I'm sure that's the wrong way. What have I done to this? Goodness gracious me, Sonia. You have got that turned turned around somehow. Up this way. Well, I can see that that's not right because this bit's supposed to be on the outside over here. Okay, now, now have I got it? I have a loop, a loopy thing there. That's twisting around. Okay. Where's this thing? Where's the thing? got him? I think so. I'm going to push it through the back and I'll see what it looks like then, eh? I must have did one big loop more than the rest of them. So now I'm going to have to try and see if I can manoeuvre it so it won't look wrong. So do you not want it looking wrong, do we? I don't know if you can see that, but I can by Jesus, and it's not, I'm not happy about that. <clears throat> If I make each one just a little bit bigger, hopefully that'll even that one out then. That's better. Right. Next one. This one should be sitting down a bit better too, I think. What it is. Now, when I'm putting these on here, let's, let's paper tick. Oh, hang on, I'm going to unwind this. It's all. So you just drop your needle down and it'll spin down. Okay, you can't see what I'm doing really, can you? But, um, unspinning the, th un spinning on the thread. Actually, I'm going to take it out of the needle because I want to un. It's all twisted up, we're going to twist it. Untwist it. Okay. Right. Now, put that in there. And when I'm doing this, pay particular attention, Sonia, what you're doing. One, make sure they're all the same. Two, I mustn't have pulled that other one down tight enough. Three, four, five, six, seven, wait a minute, no, seven, wait a minute. <laughs> I'll get seven here in a minute. Seven, eight, 
9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, I oh don't know. Be a bit mini, but it's all, it's all right. We're going to keep working with this. We're not going to. See, that's twisting as I go if I'm not careful to, to, to push it back. I'm not careful to push it back so it doesn't twist. And you've got heaps here, so you've got lots to bring out <laughs> along the thread. I've got a piece of cotton coming through the back of here with it. Where's that at? Here, look at this. It's a nice straight piece, it's just only caught in there, cut that off there, right -o. now we need this bit to be don't start twisting about on me Itself, can it? Really? <coughs> I'll take it up this way a bit. So I can make a. Just sit it down. What on earth is all this thread coming through? It must have been caught up in the cotton and I've rolled it round in. <laughs> so I didn't get more knots in it then, isn't it? Really? Still got the still got it there, look. Goodness me. Right yeah, let's have a look at this. How's it going? Not too bad. The only thing is I've done wrong is I've got these sitting way out too far. But I can put something on that, can't I? Just stop that looking like it does. I can put something there. I might do little um, spots. I'm going to just end that off there. I'm going to do some little... Um, don't you worry, I'll think about it in a minute. Some little French knots. I'm going to do some French knots. And that end bit. Around in there so I can make me feel happy about it. I did some French knots around it. This one here's got to be fixed too. It's got to be manoeuvred out to where it's supposed to be. It's incredible how I've got. See, this one's very loose, and these are two. These are tighter. <laughs> Never mind. Now let's see what colour when we do our French knots. Because I want to put them at the end there, so they're right close, and they've got to be a colour that'll show up really. Jazzy like, you know. Um, we probably need to get the cotton box out, don't we? Or one of them. First, you put the orange around there. That would look good. This is not real orange, but it's orange, orange. Yes, that'll look good. I've got a fetish, <laughs> orange fetish. <laughs> I don't think I've ever really used that much or red in the past, but I'm starting to get gamer now. <laughs> okay. I think it looked good, the French not there. I'll have a go, see what it looks like. Okay. Then it won't feel like it's floating around in the mid-air. I 
I'll do three wraps make it a good size aha uh -huh. I'm only looking at it upside down so far but I think that might look alright after because I'm running out of little minutes here. Oh geez, the day's going fast. <laughs> oh dear, got up at seven. Been here since eight. Or a bit before, I think. I'm interested in putting a leaf on here too. I find a nice leaf idea. Do a few videos today because I've got to have some inf some extras because I've got to do some house things like sorting out my clothes and that. I'm going to do that over the weekend, so I want to get some. Oh, it'll only take me a little tiny while. It's not like it's going to take forever. It's only going to take about ten. Oh well, at least an hour if that's if that might take an hour. Won't even take that probably. But you've got to you know psych yourself up, <laughs> don't you? Really. This is just evolving into a really interesting thing, I think. Some sort of a plant or other. Sort of a little bit like what the um, cruel embroidery looks like, isn't it? It's a cross between a few things. Go. I'm pleased with myself. You can can't you tell? <laughs> I'm pleased with myself. It's good when you can do something and it's not mucking up on you. Okie dokie. Well, it might have been a little bit of trial and error. Isn't isn't that gorgeous? I do love that. And now I need the most extraordinary leaves on here don't we okay and then he needs lots of brothers and sisters around him you know more more, more. okay <laughs> gonna take a little time thank you for watching everybody and i hope you like that i do and we'll get back onto it shortly okay bye bye <laughs>